Welcome to Down at the Barns, following the story of people and their love of classic cars, everything from restoration to electric conversion. Please subscribe to our channel in the link below. This week, the stag receives its final top coat of paint. Welcome to Down at the Barns. Please don't forget to subscribe. We're here today at Classic and Sports Cars Essex to see Jason. He's sprayed the two undercoats and now we've got the two top coats on. So we're gonna go in and have a look at that now. Right, Les, here it is, it's in here. Wow. So there you have it. The final product. Wow, look at that. Yeah. So just, just literally run your hand along that and feel how shiny that is. Yeah. So if you remember the last time you was here, we was just preparing the engine bay. Yeah. So here it is. The engine bay completely done, ready for you to drop all your ancillaries, cables, parts, whatever you're going to put in there. So it's going to look absolutely stunning. Absolutely stunning. Um, yeah, it's come out really well. Credit to yourself on the, all these special areas where you've decided to do it in lead properly, where a lot of people just would probably use body filler. We've done all of that, and even down to all your door shuts. It's just, it's all beautifully done, ready to go. Um, all under, all underneath is all completely stun guarded and painted, as like the top is. So it's got full protection. I mean, it's a show car. It's a real show car to show off your your work so people can actually, you could go to a show and put this up on stands and actually people could look all under it. And um, boots all done as you see, all anti-chip stone guarded again, car paint, um, you know nobody sees it but no, no, it's all done. But it's, it's about knowing what's behind it. Isn't it? It's the story, you've yeah. got a story, some people um, don't have a portfolio of a job that's been done, yours has got a portfolio with full history and you can prove and provide to someone all of the, the metal work you've had done, the panels you've had done, and even down to the paintwork. I mean, yeah. it's had a complete bare metal body re restoration, hasn't it? I mean, the whole underneath the car was scraped back, taken back to bare metal, cleaned, primed, anti-chipped and painted. Yeah. So, so yeah, so it's, it's, it's basically okay. ready for you now to um, get all your running gear on. Yeah, and then one, once you've got that on, and then we're happy we'll have it back and we will fit the bonnet boot and doors for you. And then I'm going to miss it. It's my baby. The guys from Rob Sport lay out all the parts on the floor ready to build the new chassis. Lining everything up and bolting it together takes time and patience.
first wheel for the stake. So just a quick progress update. The guys have completed the rear of the car now, put the uh, rear axles on, the suspension at the back and the back wheels are now on. And uh, we're now progressing through the front of the car. The suspension legs are on, steering racks in, uh, just getting the roll bars and things like that. And uh, another hour and we should be finished. With the four wheels in place, it's time to lower the stag and finally create the rolling chassis. So, here we are, four wheels um, and a rolling chassis, hopefully. Yeah. So. Next step is to get this onto the trailer and get it down to the barns, ready for Nick to start the electrification work. Join us next time down at the barns when the stag finally goes electric. And please don't forget to hit that subscribe button.